I was. She really nailed it. You know, both of them are very much country, which gives it up to life and things and what's going on with her dog in their back porch and real love stuff. I, I grew up listening to music, and what they both picked tonight was just brilliant. It was really beautiful. Mom's apple pie. Hit America right in the mid-drift. <laughs> I will. There will be one there for me to grab if I choose to grab it. Okay. Are you going to continue doing the solo thing, or are you going to go back to Arizona? Solo was just, you know, I'm, just, I'm in L.A., you know, I, uh, I go out and, uh, and, uh, and bump into, like, Johnny Depp and stuff, and so one thing led to another, we wrote a song, not with Johnny, but I'm just saying, uh, you know, I was kind of bored and on off time, and we wrote a great song and put it out with a book, so it was the perfect... As a judge, do the two right people get it? As a judge, do the two right people get it? Yeah, positively. When I first heard Lauren, like seven months ago, uh, it was the second city, and we were sitting there like, you know, you got to go through so many kids. And she sang, and it was, I stood up and said, thank you, Jesus. It was just, because, you know, when she sings, she doesn't try to hit the notes. They just, they just fall in her lap. Their words go to that place. Everybody else is trying to hit the notes, and I'm supposed to be judging them. You didn't sing that good. You were pitchy. She's never had a problem with pitch. Maybe bad songs, but she's been perfect and right and great. I circled her eight months ago and said, American Idol. Really? The guy saved it. Really? Oh, yeah. Well, she's, you know, her and about six or seven others, but I heard her first, and I was, <laughs> had a love for her. Stephen, you're a legend. Did the kids teach you anything? Yeah, to be humble and to, to lay back and to listen to what's going on. Whoever thought that these, I never wanted to do American Idol. I turned it on, I thought this show sucks. Um, <laughs> Uh, the, how can the kids be American idols? They haven't played clubs. They haven't played their dues. They haven't done what we did. I was wrong. I was wrong. They are out there. We just had to look, weed through a bunch of them and find them. And it's just made me um, have a whole new, I mean, how does a 15 year old sing like that? They never done a club. How, do they, how does that happen? That's magic. That's this. That's the gift. And that's what we were looking for. Of all, rap, rock collaborations of all time. Come on, run DMC. Any artist out right now that you would consider doing the same type of collaboration with right now? Well, I have an affinity for Nelly, and I don't know what he's doing, but... Uh, working on a new album. Is he? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, we did, the, we did that thing, you know, with Run DMC and Walk This Way, but, you know, I would love to do something with somebody. I love it. Two more questions, please. I'm thinking about it. No, because I wasn't, what was I singing? Wooly Bully? You know, uh, um, <clears throat> I wasn't crafting my, there weren't a lot of singers back then. I was emulating Janis Joplin and trying to figure out how not to be angelic in my voice and throw in more, blah, 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 because that's what, that's what sold. I mean, that is the kind of thing. It took me a couple years to learn that. I, I wasn't as good as they are that young. Last question. <clears throat> I wasn't. I, I knew that she, she was a little hoarse, but they have uh, steroids for that. Like if I've got a show I got to do and I'm hoarse and did two shows in a row with Aerosmith, you can take a shot of steroids. <laughs> the only problem is the next day it's not so good. I mean, you, you know, you, it gives you all that back. It gets rid of the swelling, but you really pay dearly the next day. Now, she didn't sing that much tonight. She sang two songs, three songs, and tomorrow she'll nail it. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Well, I gave it some thought. I thought, you know, the kids are out there. All I'm looking for is another Janis Joplin. You know, somebody that's, and when I say that, not to sing like Janis, but to sing like Janis, that she had that, you know, she just, it was that I was missing today, and melody line and something like that. You know, I, was, I thought maybe I could add to it. And with Randy's, you know, and J-Lo's, and, and look what we did. I'm so proud that we found what we found this year. So proud. Mm -hmm. I think they're 100% right. I mean, to, you know, what do you get with negativity and putting down? Um, a funny show, but I think you, you grow more with confidence and compliments and those kind of things. You know, a kid that's scared to death, they're sitting in front of J-Lo. These girls, they just, you know, and um, those of us that have been around forever and they're monumental to them. 
I'm just a regular guy. I mean, I am that guy in Aerosmith and I have been around, but you know, to give them confidence to feel free and come over and go, let me show you what I can do. Those are the ones I'm looking for.